Today's Coast of Cool Place and Moment certainly has to be about shocking here in the Stick Marsh. Now the thing that was so cool to me is I had heard about how they shock certain areas in certain ponds. But to actually get on the boat with Bob Eisenhower and his assistant was awesome. And the reason why is because I fully got to understand how the whole program works. But more importantly, who can say that they actually put their hands on a 10 and a half pound fish with the shocking method? Now the way that thing works is I assure you it doesn't hurt any of the fish. We go along with the net and we're scooping up the fish that have actually been stunned by the electricity going through the water and they put them in a live well. After putting them in the live well they let them come back to where they're not shocked anymore. They're in there swimming around with the aeration going on and then they measure each one of those fish and that's how a lot of the biologists are able to come up with the healthiness of the lake. Certainly if the fish are skinny per so many inches, then they might have to adjust the way they manage that place. Versus if they're too fat, then there's really no problem with that. But realistically, it was one of the coolest things that I have ever done. And to be able to actually put my hands on a 10 and a half pounder because of that method really reassured me in what the FWC is doing in managing a lot of these great lakes. You know, Bree, right after we got off the boat and we went back to doing the Sportsman's Adventure episode, they went down the shoreline another 100 yards and got another 1025. That fish that wow. I saw was 1056. Just so cool. And that it's so totally, neat as you fishermen, have. you know, you cast and cast and cast and you wonder if where you're fishing, yeah. there's fish. This is a proven method that the lakes and the systems are very healthy. That's so cool. It is. I want to do it. <laughs>